All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry, and today I'm going to show you how to get free games that are available on Epic Games. Now, the first thing you got to do is have an Epic account to go to their website, just Google Epic Games, and then download their launcher, and then periodically, I think it's weekly, you can go down here, and you can see their free games in this gray box. Currently, they have Turnip Boy Commits Tax Evasion, which is free for a limited time. And they want me to prove that I'm, you know, interested in this content. It can be a little spicy tax evasion. And then normally it's $15, but if I click on the blue button right now, I can get it for free. And then it's going to ask me if I want to share my email with the devs. I don't really want to. Um, in part because the Turnip Boy commits tax evasion devs already have my info because I've done videos of this on my gaming channel. And then once you're done, it'll email you a receipt to prove that you've purchased it and it is yours. And then you have the option of going and installing the game or going back and continuing to browse you also have what's coming up next in the order so on november 9th next week we will be getting golden light and you can click on this to see what it's like like what what is the game how much is it normally all of that good stuff so you can figure out if this is a game you want although for a lot of people who poke their head in here now and again uh, I know a lot of people who just kind of come in, grab the games when they're free, in the event that maybe some friends will want to get together down the road and play some of these games. Now, if you get one of these games and you want to download it later, but you don't like know where it is, you can always go to your library tab here on the left-hand side and search through here until you find it, or you can search game by uh, alphabetical, how much you've played, or you can search by genre. If it's in like a horror genre, that might be easier to find than just digging through the entire list alphabetically. Although they have all got pictures, so that makes it a lot easier to see what's what. So that's it for this one, ladies and gentlemen. I've been your host, Larry. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will catch you next time. Bye, everybody, and have a good one.